Hey internet, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. As you can see behind me, I have someone on the screen. This is John Green, and occasionally Emily Grassley will be popping up. I'm currently watching the Project for Awesome live stream. So naturally, I felt like it was important to talk to you guys today about what Project for Awesome is, and why you should be checking it out, and just in general, why I devote so much time during this time of year to watching it. Project for Awesome was created back in 2007 by the Green brothers, John and Hank Green, and their goal was to trick the trending algorithm to showing videos about charity. They encouraged people to make videos about their favorite charity, and then they did this stream where they had people, a bunch of people, the whole community, go to these different videos and comment spam them, basically. Like, you just commented a bunch on the videos and watched it a bunch of times. YouTube picked up that a bunch of these videos were being watched a whole lot and started recommending them to other people. And so the goal was to just get people's awareness up about Project for Awesome. So this is their 10th year doing Project for Awesome. Last year they raised over a million dollars. I think they might have raised over a million the year before. And it's just this really amazing, amazing, amazing thing. And I know I've talked about it before on this channel, but I wanted to go a little bit more into depth. Of the 10 projects for Awesome that John and Hank have done, I believe that I've been a part of four of them. So the shirt that I'm currently wearing was one of the perks for one of them. And I think that might have been 2012, 2012, 2013, 2014, 2015. I don't know, but the point is that I have been involved with Project for Awesome since but I think 2012 since I started watching John and Hank's videos and I just love it. It's one of my favorite times in the year. It comes right before Christmas and it's just like this overwhelming sense of goodness that gets to be put into the world. So there's a couple different parts to Project for Awesome. The first of which is that they ask everyone to make a video about their favorite charity and upload it to YouTube. Then you submit it to the Project for Awesome website and you get the chance to see all of the videos that different people have made about their charities. Now this is one thing that I actually have never done. It's never worked out for me that year and I should prioritize it higher next year. Next year I will focus on making a video. But what Project for Awesome has done for me is it has introduced me to a bunch of charities that I didn't know anything about and so I think that is a really great thing that they do. Project for Awesome has also morphed a little bit over time. So initially it started with just having this live stream and showing all of these different um, person made videos, viewer made videos, and the ones that ended up getting the most views would be the ones that the money to charity went to that they raised during the live stream. So that's the second part of it is that they have this page that you can go to and donate and there's different perks that you can sign up for or you can just give money and all of this goes to Project for Awesome and it gets split in different ways. Over the last couple of years they've been doing something a little bit differently. So this is a 48 hour live stream. It started today at noon eastern time and it will go into until Sunday. The first 24 hours they're raising money for Save the Children and Partners for Health, which are two large global charities that are doing things with healthcare and with children. And they just actually had one of the guys from Save the Children on talking about what they do and it's really amazing and they do a lot of good work and the really exciting thing about these charities is that you know that they've been vetted and you know that when you're giving money it's going to a good place. For the second 24 hours the money that is raised is split between I think it might be the top 10 charities of the viewer submitted videos. You can always find more information at projectforawesome.com slash about I believe if I'm not saying any of this stuff right. The really awesome thing that tends to happen is that they get donors who match donations and so right now every one dollar that you were spending is basically multiplied by four because there are donors John and Hank are donors save the children are matching donations and partners for health are matching donations so the money that you spend if you spend five dollars you're actually sending twenty dollars to project for awesome and it's going to be split to these amazing charities and obviously a major component is this 48 hour long live stream where they have all of these different guests and they cycle through and right now a of course, Emily Grassley is on, and I can't believe I decided to film during this because I'm missing it, and I love Emily Grassley, but there's going to be so many really amazing creators on. So, if you have any time between now and Sunday at noon Eastern time, tune in to projectforawesome.com slash live, and you'll get to see the live stream. Uh, you can go to projectforawesome.com slash donate to donate to the fund, to the Indiegogo campaign. Regrettably this year, I am in a financial situation where it has to be the first year that I just cannot in good conscience donate money. I don't have the money to spend, and I'm really sad about it. But if you are able to, if this is something that you feel like you are capable of spending money for, please, please, please go donate. There's so much good that can be done in the world, and it's something that, like, we really need right now. I'm just obviously really excited about it. <laughs> 
<laughs> let me know if you've ever uh, participated in Project for Awesome and what your favorite part of it is about and if you made a video let me know about that as well. Okay I'm gonna get back to watching the stream. Thank you guys as always for watching and I will see you all tomorrow.